good morning everybody so in this lesson we are going to learn how you can take a site collection backup in sharepoint 2016 and the same steps are applicable for sharepoint 2013 and sharepoint 20 as well 2010 i apologize so let's see the process the process is pretty simple uh, you see the center admin interface in front of you so if i want to take a site collection backup i just need to click on this site collection backup link here i have the option to change my site collection but for this testing purpose i want to use the same path that i have here so i'm going to put the file name in this format you see it's here and uh, make sure you put it in this format if you directly put c drive backup and whatever name it's not going to recognize and then you're going to click on start backup here it gives me the error message the file already exists so i need to check this overwrite existing file but if you are doing it for the first time you don't need to select any option like that now i click start backup and you see it's already in progress you can refresh it to check the status now it is initializing so now after some time we see the operation is over and it succeeded and uh, if you go to the location you're gonna see this file that we created right now there is no content in the site collection so you do not have any huge file size here now, if you want to know more what exactly happens when you go for this option so you can go for this job status what SharePoint does internally is it creates a timer job or I should better say it's a one-time timer job and that job is responsible so this directory that you select should have uh, been access should have been accessible by the timer service account you use if you don't do that it's not gonna work for you so we are trying to locate the job yeah so here as you see I have highlighted this site collection backup and uh, it was successful this is how you proceed this is a very simple process and I hope you like it so please do not forget to post your comments and any questions or anything else you want to see and I'll try to help you as much as I can. Thank you.